Might as well just uh, show up with all the uh, quote batteries I got. I think it's bigger than today's rolls. You pretty much need uh, old tiny these. Old tiny these anyway, in case uh, you got a. Uh, say in case, uh, uh, in case you need to charge your batteries and you have no power source anywhere. Yeah, it's a whole bunch here anyway. Whole bunch of batteries here anyway. Whole bunch of batteries anyway. Also, uh, this video also shot about say portable lighting capabilities I have. Like portable lighting, which is also which also be useful, say in case of say a failure and all that. So then we'll go through all these individually. Individually, like say one by one and shit like that. Oh, maybe yeah, I might, or I might not. And all these here, I do have say how they can be plugged into. How they can be plugged into. They can charge them up anyway, with the exception of this one. That uh, uses a separate outlet. So I'll go through them. Oh. This one here is pretty much just a portable battery that could be used to charge a laptop. Like the Dell laptop I have. In case of any failure or whatever in power. Like any case. I'm sure you've probably seen that. You might have seen that in a bit. You might have seen that in a previous video. Yeah, figure is just a, it can also be used to charge USB devices. Function as a portable bat, whatever. But just use that just in case uh there's like an outage, whatever, and the laptop needs to re recharge, whatever. This could probably be used for that anyway. To charge it up and all that shit. Yeah, figure. Yeah, figure it extends its usage in a, in a blackout. All that shit. This one here is like a huge uh, capacity. A larger capacity battery. Like this one here has a capacity of, say, 32,000 milliamp hours. Char recharges it to standard USB. Yeah, it's always better to have more capacity than you than you really need because you never know what the fuck. It's always better to be better. It's always better to have more capacity than you need, or it's always better even then over when it comes to capacity to recharge it in the event of say power failures and all that. You'd be better off say. It's always better to be over prepared than under prepared. Input there. Yeah, that one here holds the largest capacity. This one here is a newer addition too. Like a larger capacity battery. This one here has like say a capacity of 20,100 milliamp hours. Ninja battery. And USB-C is uh, for charging and all that shit. I know. Uh, this one here is like the oldest. So it has 22,000 milliamp hours. So I bought this one. I pretty much like say had like say lesser amount of uh, equipment that requires multiple batteries for recharging and shit. But I might end up plug him in anyway just to uh. Oh, after I'm done uh, filming each one of these, I'm probably going to end up plugging them in anyway individually just to, uh... Yeah, to make sure you have adequate charging, have adequate full charge and all that shit. Yeah, I figure this is like a lot of, like a lot of batteries anyway. 
I still got more I have to go through anyway. And some of you might have seen in previous videos already. So we'll go to the rest. So we'll go to the rest of them as quickly as possible. Well, these power batteries are pretty much like say, so I imagine, I imagine say, when you let's say if you re-upped your membership with the, with the NRA, like I've done. So here has a 10,000 million power capacity. And this one has 4,500 milliamp hour capacity. Yeah, I figure it's always good to expand your capacity. Yeah, I figure, I figure if you get something for free anyway, this one uses USB-C ports as well. Oh well. I'll probably check too out huh? while well, I'm at and say when I'm done. Those air portal batteries, I gotta recharge it now when they're done. This will probably go in there too and uh, this one will go in there too and be checked out and this one will be checked out too. Might as well just check out the other batteries too while I'm at where I had the rest of them. And this here is pretty much like say, the smallest capacity bear I have. This one holds maybe three thousand milliamp hours. You can't see it, but this one here holds more. This one holds Sixty-seven hundred milliamp hours. And this one you probably have seen because that's like the cheap uh, O and N uh, portable battery that was bought at Walmart. And O and N is uh, Walmart's in-house brand, and this is their cheap uh, model anyway. The cheap model at the time I bought this, and that's always been used to charge up shit anyway. So as a series of tests. Yeah, I figure these ones here. Yeah, I figure this one's been put there so many tests anyway. A few tests already. It might, not get, it, might, it might end up getting put to more tests, but who knows. I'll probably just end up saying, I might just buy another one just to, if I buy any more batteries, I might just buy a larger capacity one that, that could replace both of these at the same time. Which I might do, who knows. If I could find some use, I might find some use out of this one. And this here is a uh, portable power station. It is it's a Westinghouse iGen 300S. Backwards input there. You can plug USB out. It even has a portable. Even has a light here. Six watt hour capacity. I have usually I have tested this out on a few items. My original intention for this was just to <coughs> make it a couple hours extra hours on a cable modem. Send it back up a save a power outage. And to save the uninterruptible power supply for the cable, it runs dry. 
This could probably use maybe to keep it going for a whole lot longer. That's the that's like the purpose for that. But it's working when I did and I've tested out on some shit already. But this is much more but it was a better price for this on Amazon than it was like say through other places. Who knows? I might not buy, I might not buy a larger capacity one or two of them. Two of them with much larger capacity use those to power the cable modems if necessary. This could also be used for say power and lights too if necessary. Oh well. Now I wanted to say <clears throat> now I wanted to say my backup lighting equipment in case of a power failure and all that shit. Old time lighting in here. <clears throat> lighting and batteries for whatever. Triple A's. That'll be that'll be explained. So here's a Yeah, but in our land, that was probably like one of the upsides of say of extending membership to the NRA and all that shit. Where's one of them anyway? One of those portable lights anyway. Touch that and, and it turns on. Plugs around the USB outlet. This you can plug right into a port one of those uh, portable power banks that uh, uses USB ports and shit like that. Oh yeah, this is like a lantern. That's what the batteries are for. Figures four D's. They've never been used yet. Yeah, if I can afford those. Flashlight. Which will never get used. Now I want to hear a flashlight that uh, uses AAA batteries. Has it been used? The batteries in there. I'm probably gonna get some batteries for that. Oh yeah. A portable lamp. You can plug this in USB, I'll just got a switch here and This is very useful, say any This is also very useful in the blackout too. Yeah, for these four bat uses a triple A bat triple A batteries. And we'll get on to the rest of it. Yeah, for almost some sort of shit off of here and uh I'll show you the final the final uh, parts of it. Uh parts of it uh, let's say of all the uh, backup lighting and all that shit. Or all the, all the backup supplies and shit. Here's the final part of the video. <laughs> yeah, another portable battery. Another power bank. This one has like say 26,800 milliamp hours. But what about this one? Is it has a power display. Tells you how much is in there and all that shit. And here it is as a uh, this one here can also function as a jump starter. Got some poor outlets there. I saw I 
out with there in case. <clears throat> yeah, I figure these two here will probably port, 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 could be used for say that uh, portable uh, light that uses USB port uh, for power. So I figure both these will run as anyway. Yeah, figure this one here out of you. But the problem was that doesn't have much capacity anyway. Any larger capacity for everything to work properly. Like larger capacity just for say something like a cable modem. I might use so many watts anyway. And you can definitely say that's it for for this video here. I just got these guys that should be organized and put back in the order. Well, you can definitely set the bay right there. <laughs>